Howdy cowboys and cowgirls, it's me, Cowboy Jack. Hey, today, I've got all this stuff with me. You know, every once in a while we all have chores to do, and I've got some chores today. I need to wash Cowboy Caden's sheets, so I brought him here to the Clean Spin Washateria in Spring, Texas. They're about to have their grand opening. It's gonna be really cool, and it's so nice and clean in there. Perfect place for doing your laundry. You guys wanna learn about how a laundromat works and all the tools that you use to get your clothes clean? Come on, let's go check it out. Whoa, this is gonna be really, really cool. So when you first come in, you might wanna grab a cart. They have these really fun carts here where you can put your laundry right in there. See, I've got Cowboy Caden's Toy Story sheets. Wow, wait a second, how did this guy get in there? This is, this is, this guy's actually really cool. Check him out. <laughs> That's my buddy Rocky the raccoon. And we're actually gonna wash him today because he got a little bit dirty. You know, one of Cowboy Jack's puppy dogs thought this was a puppy toy, but we actually use this to play with each other. So we need to wash that. And I've got his pillowcase here. I thought I saw something else in here too. What did we have? Oh yeah, Cowboy Caden's favorite shirt. <laughs> Look at that. That's his Cowboy Jack shirt and we're gonna wash that too. All right, well now that we got this in this really fun cart, see this thing has four wheels on it and it can move all around so you can spin it any way you want. It's really, really fun. Well, we need to put it in a machine, right? And wash it. But before we can do that, I forgot to bring laundry detergent. It's so great. They actually have a vending machine full of laundry detergent that we can go get some from. You guys wanna come check it out? <laughs> So a lot of laundromats, whenever you're doing your laundry, you have to put in coins and things like that and paper money. Here, they have these really cool things. Look at this. That's like a card that you use to run all the machines. And you put it right here, or I'm sorry, you put it right here, and that's how it loads up all of the money so that you can use it to get your laundry done. Let's go over here to the vending machine. Whoa, see, there's a lot of laundry in here today. So, Cowboy Jack really loves a lot of different smells. One of my favorites is Game Laundry Detergent. So I'm gonna use this card and this machine to get some. Let's see here, so I'm just gonna place this here. And look at that, I want, you guys think I want the number 401 or 403? They're exactly the same, but I like 403, that's fun. So look, I'm gonna push that number in right here. Four, zero, three. Okay, now let's see if it falls. Wow, that was really cool. Look at that, now we have our own bottle of laundry detergent to use to wash Cowboy Kate in sheets and his t-shirt and even Rocky the raccoon, let's go. See, they have all different sizes of machines here. It's really fun. This is a really small washing machine. Take a look inside there. See, you couldn't fit all the things that we have in here. That's just if you have a really small load of clothes or laundry or sheets to wash. But we're gonna use this medium-sized machine right here. See, this one's a little bit bigger and you can fit more stuff in it. But you know what? They even have some bigger, bigger machines. You guys wanna see those big machines before we get started? Come right over here. Wow, guys, come look at this. This is the large washing machine and it's really huge. Look at all that space it's got inside of there. You can wash a really big comforter, really big sheets, or a whole, whole lot of clothes at one time and that thing, it's huge. All right, so here we are. It's time to do the laundry. I've got my basket full of our stuff and it's time to get going. So I'm gonna load these in there. Does that look like me? I think it looks like me. What a great looking shirt. Anyways, get in there. Now, Cowboy Cadence sheets. This is a fitted sheet. These are really tricky to, to try to fold because they have these elastic bands on them. I'm not very good at it, but we'll give it a try once we get them dry. Anyway, do you guys see what's on Cowboy Cadence sheets? Let me hold that up so you can see. These are really, really fun. There's my friends Buzz and Woody and Jesse, and even the little alien from Toy Story. 
Cowboy Caden really loves Toy Story and that's why we love these sheets. So there's this flat sheet, here's this pillowcase, and then poor Rocky the raccoon, we're gonna watch him spin. All right, Rocky, hang on tight, buddy. So now that we got him loaded in there, I'm gonna close this door. It's got a big old handle on it. There we go. I need to add our laundry detergent now. So I'll just open this up and you see, it's got a little chart here that shows all kinds of things. This is where your detergent goes. This is the softener. This is if you're using a second cycle and then if you were gonna use some bleach. So today I'm just gonna use laundry detergent. So I'm gonna put it in this front bin right here. Let's see, let's measure it out. You guys wanna help me measure? I think for this many sheets, I just need one cap full. Whoa, look at that. All right, now look at that. Wow, that's laundry detergent. Let's just pour it on in there. Wow, watch it run down there. That is really cool. Now I'm just gonna shake that off, put the cap back on, and let's get to washing. All right, now I need to get my Clean Spin Washateria card again, and I put it right here. And for these, those are white items, are really light colored, so I am going to put it on cold water and just say start. And then it's gonna start to spin, you guys watch. There we go, so it should start filling up with water right now. I can hear a lot of things happening. There it goes, there's Rocky the raccoon spinning all around. He's getting all mixed up in Cowboy Caden's sheets. Buzz and Woody are getting the ride of their lives right now. Wow, and see, you can start to see the soap and the bubbles come down because we added the laundry detergent and now the machine is adding the water. Look at that, it's spinning all around. See, right now it's spinning clockwise because if you look at the face of a clock, it goes like this, all the way from uh, one right here, all the way back over to 12 here. Look at all those bubbles, that's so cool. It's like a car wash, but for your clothes and they're getting all cleaned up. Oh wow, look in there. It's really tumbling them. This is so exciting. I've never seen one of these machines. My machine at home has a door on the top, and so you can't really see the clothes spinning around. This is really exciting to see that. And see, some people have laundry machines at their own house where they can wash and dry clothes right in their utility room or maybe in the garage or outside on the patio. People have them all over the place. You never know, everybody's different, right? But some folks don't have laundry machines right at their house, so they come somewhere just like this, the Clean Spin Washateria right in Spring, Texas. It's so fun, so amazingly clean in here. And while we're waiting on our clothes to wash, there's so much exploring we can do. You guys wanna come check some things out with me? Come on. Wow. Boy, I've never seen a fan like that before. Have you guys? I bet that thing spins really fast and moves a whole lot of air, which is good because once all these dryers get running, dryers use heat to dry our clothes, right? And so it probably might get a little bit warm in here. That fan will move a ton of air and so you don't get hot while you're washing your clothes. Wait a second, wait a second. Look at this right here. There's all these different color balloons. Those are really cool. You guys wanna name the colors with me real quick? Looks like we've got pink, blue, yellow. Come on, there's more. We've got white, green all the way over here, and then way up top. I mean, Cowboy Jack's kind of a tall guy, but I can't reach all the way up there. Maybe I could use my hat. Wait a second, are you guys laughing at my hair? <laughs> and I'm just gonna use my hat real quick to touch the red balloon. Look at that all the way up there, the red balloon. Okay, okay, stop laughing, I'll put my hat back on. Whew, okay. Now they have something really cool here at Clean Spin Washateria. It's called the Kids Corner. You guys wanna go check it out with me? Come on. Wow, these are really huge machines right here. But look at this kid's corner. 
Now, Cowboy Jack's kind of a big guy, so I can't sit down here, but they have all these great chairs. This one, these two look like unicorns. I love unicorns because they're just like horses, except they have a little horn on their head. And then over here, they have a shark chair. But this fantastic mural on the wall, somebody came in here and painted all of this, and it's so beautiful. It's like a little town here. That's really, really fun. And of course, they've got a good chair for us big kids because you know, we're gonna be here a while. It takes a minute to spin those clothes, so I might need to sit down and relax for a second. Whew. Yeah, that's nice. Wow, cowboys and cowgirls. See the way those clothes are spinning in there? That looks like a really foamy ocean or something. It's crazy. It's really washing them so good. And all that laundry detergent that we put in there is making everything nice and clean. <laughs> all right, cowboys and cowgirls. Well, laundry can kind of take a long time. That cycle still has about another 14 minutes on it. That's a long time. I worked up a little bit of an appetite and they have snacks here. You guys want to get a snack with me? Have you ever used a vending machine before? They can be really fun. It's kind of like how we got our laundry detergent a minute ago, except there's food in it. And I saw they have goldfish in here. I love goldfish and so does Cowboy Caden. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my card right here and it looks like I want number 160. So I'm going to put 160 and there they go. They dropped down. Wow, look at that, my very own bag of colorful goldfish. These are going to be fun to sit down and eat, but I need something to drink too. You know what? I haven't drank enough water today. It's really good to stay hydrated. You always have to remember to drink plenty of good water, and that can be ice water out of the refrigerator, ice water out of the tap, even bottled water. They have bottled water in this vending machine right here. So again, I use my card, put it right here, and I'm going to say, Let's see B2. I want to see that one fall. You guys ready? Whoa! <laughs> it fell all the way down here. I need to get... <gasps> ah, I'm just kidding. There's nothing in there. Let me grab that. Look at that. A really great bottle of water. So let me get my card. Let's go find a nice spot to sit down and enjoy these snacks at. All right, cowboys and cowgirls. Well, now that I got a nice, comfortable spot, let's eat some goldfish together. We just need to take a minute to relax, you know? Whew. Cool off a little bit. Wait a second. Again? You're laughing in my hair? Okay, I'll put it back on. Here we go. Whew. Goldfish coming up. Let's see. Here's an orange goldfish. That looks really tasty. Yep. Good. A red goldfish. That one tastes exactly the same. That's weird. Hmm. A green goldfish. Classic orange colored goldfish. These are really tasty, but they're making me thirsty. And remember, like I said, it's great to stay hydrated. So let's just have a little bit of water. Mm. Wow, that is delicious cold water. That's so good. It's always good to stop and take a break every once in a while. You need to make sure you don't get too hungry, have a snack, and always drink plenty of water, especially while we're doing laundry. You know, every once in a while, we also could even stop and take a deep breath. It's good to take a deep breath. It helps you relax. Sit up real straight in your chair. Whew, Cowboy Jack's bad about slouching over. That's not good. We always try to sit straight up. I always try to remind Cowboy Kane of that so he doesn't slouch over like I do. But we'll sit up straight and we'll take a big breath on three. You guys want to do it with me? Let's count together. One, two, three. I feel better. Let's check on our clothes. Looks like they're still spinning away over here. And the timer says 12 minutes. Wow, look at them, they're bubbling. They've got so much air mixed around in them. They're getting extremely clean. This is such a fantastic brand new machine here.
I don't see, oh, I do see Rocky the raccoon. He's all the way in the back way back there. He waved at me. Let's look real close and see if we can find him. Wait, I see him. He's right there. Hey, Rocky. You doing okay, buddy? There he goes. It's time to spin around. I wonder if he's getting dizzy in there. You know, sometimes when we spin around and around, we get a little bit dizzy. That's what Rocky's going through right now, but he's going to be just fine. He's going to be super clean and fluffy. He, like, he hadn't been that fluffy in a long, long time. It's actually really fun to get clean things. So like I said, doing laundry is like a chore. And sometimes that's part of our job. You know, everybody gets different chores to do around the house. Sometimes it's adults doing the laundry. Sometimes it says kiddos doing the laundry. Today, I'm doing the laundry and washing Caden's sheets. Even though they're not mine, it's part of my job to do part of a lot of the help around the house. Wow, I think this is the spin cycle because it's spinning really fast. Let's see if I can keep, keep up with it. No, that's impossible. It's going way too fast. What it's doing is it's spinning so fast to drive all of the water out of it. And it's gonna go ahead and rinse it, I think, one more time. But it's trying to get all that soap and everything out of there. Wow, guys, just exploring around here, there's so much to see. And things we don't see every day and some things we do see every day. I came across this beautiful yellow bunch of flowers. Look at those. Get a real close look. <laughs> So these are actually mums grown right here in Texas. And it's almost perfect to have them in here because they like an average room temperature, medium light, and I bet they're gonna do fantastic in here. I don't know much about flowers. I'm not really a green thumb kind of guy. I have a hard time keeping up with all the flowers in our flower beds at home. But anyways, I bet these guys really like it here at Spin Cycle because it's nice and bright. The temperature's the same year round. None of these crazy Texas weather swings like we're having right now. I just can't get over how huge some of these machines are. I mean, this is the biggest dryer they have here. You guys want to look inside? Take a look in there. Whoa! I mean, I bet you could fit a king-size comforter, sheets, maybe even a pillow or two in here. It's so huge. And I love how this shiny surface feels. It's nice and cold and clean. Wow. Well, see, we have to find things to occupy our time, and I don't really know what to do. We could sit down and take a nap. I mean, it's good to take a nap. Everybody needs a nap every once in a while. Or we can just keep exploring, because, I mean, there's so much to look at. Oh, wow. I found something right over here. Let's go check this out. Do you guys see what this is? This is really important, especially for our safety. We've even met a fireman on the show before. This is a fire extinguisher. So if all of these machines use really hot temperatures to dry our clothes, and there's a lot of moving parts, and with any big electric machinery, anything can happen, right? So it's good to have something like a fire extinguisher around. If there was ever any smoke or any kind of fire, the first thing you would do is call 911. But the second thing you could do is grab the fire extinguisher and try to put it out yourself. You don't actually try to put it out yourself, you try to contain it until the fire department gets here because those firefighters are professionals. They know exactly what they're doing. Wow, and I love how they have these spinny carts all over the place. They're really fun because they go in any direction. Woo! <laughs> all right. Oh wow, wait a second. See, like we talked about how those clothes were spinning clockwise? They have a clock on the wall right here so we can tell what time of day it is. And as you can see, those hands move around this way as the day gets longer, and it'll tell us what time it is. Really cool. All right, cowboys and cowgirls, it's getting closer to being finished with the wash cycle. Everything has been getting so clean in there. Rocky the raccoon waved at me just a minute ago, let me know everything was A-OK -okay and that he was feeling really clean. See, look right here. This is the timer and it says we have five minutes left. So I bet you it's probably get, oh, see, look. It started out on the wash cycle 
then it went to the rinse cycle. Right now it's on the spin cycle. So it's gonna start spinning these really, really fast to get all of the moisture, as much of the moisture as we can, out of those things that we just washed. And it's gonna go really fast. That's why there's all those holes there. Not only does that help wash it, but it also helps to drain it off. And that's really neat. All right, cowboys and cowgirls, it's been a while and our clothes are completely clean. Our sheets, Rocky the Raccoon, and even Cowboy's, Cowboy Cadence Cowboy Jack shirt. So see, it says open door right there and zero minutes left. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the handle and open the door up and pull our things out and put them in this cart. So, whew, here's the pillowcase. Well, I think I got just a big glob of everything here. That's hard to figure that out. Okay, here's the fitted sheet. Or no, that's the flat sheet. Here's the fitted sheet, because it's got that stretchy stuff on it. Still a great looking t-shirt. Smells great already. And then our buddy Rocky the raccoon. Hey, buddy Rocky, how you doing, man? You look fantastic, but don't you want to get dry? You're still a little bit damp. Let's go ahead and take you over there and get you in the dryers. All right. So, let's just go on down the road here. See, it's really cool that we have these carts to carry our laundry around. And I'm just gonna come right over here to this machine. This looks like a great one, doesn't it? So, again, I gotta use my card, and I'm gonna use this upper unit. Cowboy Jack's a little bit tall, and I don't wanna bend down that far. But if I was washing a whole bunch of stuff, it'd be cool that I could run a whole bunch of machines at the same time. So, I'm gonna open it up and load our stuff in. I'm gonna save Rocky for the last. So I'll put his t-shirt in there, the fitted sheet, the flat sheet, this pillowcase. Wait a second, this pillowcase is inside out. Wait a second, guys, we forgot to talk about this guy. You remember from Toy Story? That's Rex, the T-Rex. Forgot to talk about him. Oh, and of course, Buzz and Woody are sitting on RC right there. All right. All right, Rocky, I know it's gonna make you a little bit dizzy, but just hang on for the ride, buddy, because you're gonna get all dry and fluffy again, all right? Let's put him right there. <laughs> Guys, look at Rocky in there. All right, buddy. It's gonna be just fine. <laughs> He's gonna be so happy he's all dry and fluffy. All right. All right, so see we can choose medium temp, high temp, low temp, or delicate. And since these are sheets and a t-shirt, we're just gonna go with medium temperature and I'm gonna push start. Whoops, I need to do that. I didn't move fast enough. So there we go, medium temp, I'm gonna push start. There we go, and now he's fixing to start spinning. There goes Rocky, and there goes those sheets. And see, what this does is it tumbles them a whole lot really fast, but it also has air moving through there. Really hot air, well, medium temperature air, because that's what I selected, right? And it's just gonna tumble these until they're really dry. Let's just watch it go around for a second. It's really cool. Now, if you watch too closely, you could get kind of dizzy. Wow. And see, you can see Cowboy Caden's shirt getting blown by air right in there already. Now it's gonna reverse flow, get everything super dry. Rocky the raccoon was doing some somersaults back there. And guys, if you hear a sound, that's the sound of air moving, because this is a big commercial dryer and it moves a whole lot of air to dry your clothes off really fast and efficiently. All right, cowboys and cowgirls, see these clothes are spinning really, really fast and all that air's moving to make them extra, extra dry. I think they're just about done. I'm gonna check it out. Whoop. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Still looks like me. All right, let me get one of these baskets. Throw that in here. Sheets are great. Oh, they feel so soft. That's nice. All 
My buddy Rocky's all fluffed out. All right, Rocky's gonna help us fold these sheets real quick. Let's go all the way over here. See, and these are tables you can use to fold things. So Rocky, you sit right there, buddy. Now, first I'm gonna fold Caden's flat sheet. Whoa! This thing is really big. It's usually easier to do this with two people, but I think I can still manage it. So see right there, I've got it all spread out. Pinch it together. Now, one more time. Everybody folds differently, but that's how I do it. And see, look at that. His flat sheet is perfectly folded. It's inside out, I did it backwards, but that's okay. <laughs> now the pillowcase, that's easy. Again, let's take one quick look at all my buddies on here. We've got Woody, Buzz, RC, Jesse, even the little army guys, I missed them earlier. And then there's Rex. All right, let's get this folded. Whew. This one's a lot easier to fold because it's not quite as big as that big sheet. Now I'm just gonna place that there. Now, the fitted sheet. You can ask your mom or dad about this. Folding fitted sheets is a really big job and it's really hard. You know how I like to fold them? I just hold it out like this and I go. Just kidding, that's not how we fold them. <laughs> So, what you do, and it's a little bit tricky, it's a good thing we have this table here. So, what you're gonna do is put it out as big as you can and try to grab it by the corner. See, it actually has corners built into it. I found one right there. Now, let's see. Where's the corner? See, these things are tricky. Here it is. So I've got the two corners. <laughs> and what you do is you just pinch those corners out so that it's almost like a normal square, even though these are a little bit weird. That's about the best we're gonna do. So we just fold it like that and pretend like it's nice and neat. I bet your parents probably have a better way to do it than I do, but that's the best I got. And see, it's not perfect, but it's not terrible either. <laughs> Cowboy Cadence Cowboy Jack shirt. These are so fun. T-shirts are really fun to fold. A lot of people have different ways of folding them. Sometimes people will watch a video online and say, oh, you just pinch this right here and it ends up perfect. I can't figure that out. So what I like to do is I hold it out from me like this. I tuck those sides in and then boom, Cowboy Jack all folded up. And then of course, my buddy Rocky the raccoon. He is all dried out, all fluffed out, and he hadn't looked this great in years. Hey buddy, it's good to see you. Look, he's excited. <laughs> all right, well, I'm not gonna take their basket home with me. I brought my own, right? So I pick up my laundry. I'm gonna put this back where I got it because we don't wanna leave a mess for anybody else. We clean up after ourselves, right? So I just put that back there. Remember when I brought this in, this was a big old mess. It was all jumbled up in here. Now it's nicely folded and ready to take home and put away in its right spot. Wow, okay. So let me get the rest of my stuff here. I've got my laundry detergent, my goldfish, my water, all of these things. And I'll just put them right in here and we're good to go. All right, cowboys and cowgirls. Wow, we've had such a great time here today at Clean Spin Washeteria in Spring, Texas. We've learned a lot about these gigantic big machines and how they work and spin our clothes to get them nice and dry in this one and really fast and soapy and wet in this one to get it washed. It's, been, it's so much spinning, my head's spinning. All right, but the good thing is we did our part, we took care of our chores and we washed those clothes, right? And we learned a lot while we did it. We even had a healthy snack. Well, goldfish aren't exactly the healthiest snack, but it, 
we had a good time with them anyways, right? And I'm really glad I drank that water because you gotta stay hydrated. So anyways, cowboys and cowgirls, make sure to click subscribe to Cowboy Jack on YouTube right here. That way you can follow us on all of our adventures because we try to do a new adventure every single week. It's a lot of fun. And of course, parents, make sure to follow us on Instagram, Patreon, Cameo, Facebook, TikTok. We got them all, any kind of socials. Our links are on our Facebook page. Anyways, guys, well, thanks for coming along with me today. And until next time I see you, 